the Pike County Conservation District is giving back to the community in celebration of Earth Day. They'll be handing out red bud tree seedlings all week and offering helpful advice on how to keep the planet clean. Mountaintop News spoke with District Administrative Secretary Lisa Birchfield to learn more. We just want everybody to kind of turn their attention towards the environment and think about ways that they can do to help protect it, whether it be recycling, uh, start a compost, uh, just anything that will help, even if it's just going out and picking up garbage in your neighborhood, anything that's going to help protect the environment. And today, because it is Earth Day, we have some free tree seedlings to give out, and they are red bud. Do have just a limit on those. We didn't keep back a lot from the tree seedling giveaway, but we did keep some. Paint a rock, help paint a garden, plant some flowers. Uh, so we'd just like to encourage everybody to get your kids, your grandkids, nieces, nephews, whatever, outside and just plant a tree with them or something other and just talk to them about ways that they can help save our environment. At Audiology Associates of Prestonsburg, you can live your life the way you want and find the freedom of better hearing. With 40 years of being in the hearing care industry, you'll experience patient care that is specific to you with exceptional follow-up care that ensures your hearing and balance needs are being met. Audiology Associates at 1428 North Lake Drive in Prestonsburg. The Conservation District wants to inform others about the importance of protecting the environment. There are plenty of ways a single person can help. Of course, recycling is always a big issue. There are so many ways that we can use, reuse, so much of our stuff that we do, milk jugs. I mean, there are so many other things that kids can do with milk jugs. I mean, make a birdhouse out of it, you know, and show kids that, you know, everything isn't always just garbage. Our environment provides so much stuff for us. I mean, if everybody cuts down our trees, we don't have any more trees that people don't keep replanting them, we're not going to have air to breathe. <laughs> so, you know, we have to take care of it for it to take care of us. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Nick Collum.